What is up, guys? Today we're shopping. A lot. We're gonna go to four different stores and just rummage around. We're gonna go to TJ Maxx, Marshalls, Target, and Ross. Hi, excuse the pimple cream. I realized that TJ Maxx and Marshalls are kind of like sister stores. So I went to Old Navy instead. I, I did really bad at explaining this, so I'm just gonna do it right now. I have three ratings. We rated them off of selections, pricing, and quality. So yeah, that's what I did. Okay, bye. I'm literally sitting right outside of Target, so that's gonna be our first spot that we hit. What the fuck? I didn't know it was this windy. They already have bathing suits up. It's January. I'm gonna try my best to like come up with an outfit and then try it on. Okay, I'm being distracted. Look what I just found. I feel like this might look really good. This is interesting, but what the heck? This is like a blanket. These sweaters are so cute. I feel like I have to try one. Let's do this one. So I have a few outfits here and here. And I tried grabbing like multiple aesthetics. So let's see how this looks. First outfit. I'm indifferent about it. I kind of like it though. Why do I kind of like it? It's $50, I think. I don't know if I pay this much, but it is cute. I think I just found the best pair of jeans. Like. And this sweater is really, really cute. I would probably get a size up, but this is cute. I wish it was more flared at the bottom, but love it. Love this one. The jeans are 28 and the sweater is 25 So together, this is like over 50 I like these. I like the shape of them a lot. I don't like the material. It's giving cardboard. Yeah, this is $30. This shirt literally looks like a blanket. <laughs> I had to try it on. $25. I'm pretty sure the pants are about the same. $29. And I even got a jacket here to try. This is $60. Okay, I actually really love this jacket. But this is really good material. It's heavy, durable, soft. It's time to rate Target. The selections were so good. I feel like they have clothes for everyone, ranging from like 15 to 40, honestly. Pretty good, that's a good range. You know, the cargos were a little bit lower quality, but they were $30, so it's kind of expensive. But the sweaters were on point. They were thick, they were chunky. So overall, good selections. I give it like a nine and a half out of 10. Pricing, I would give it like a seven and a half out of 10. For the most part, everything was good quality. The jacket was, the jeans were, the sweaters were. I give quality an eight and a half out of 10. Now I think I wanna hit TJ Maxx, which is like literally right across the street right there. I'm looking at it right now. Why did I park so far away? Ooh. I love the aesthetic that TJ Maxx has. This entire jacket for $25, it would have been 60 at Target. I just had to show you this. Oh, it's only $10, guys. They have so many cute two pieces. For $25, you can get two turtlenecks. And different, there's different colors too. Oh my God, this is a three pack for $20. Oh, this overall is cute. Okay, I'm gonna grab some cute stuff, see what kind of outfits I can make, and then I'll get back to you. TJ Maxx has a lot of athleisure wear, so I thought it was only fair to try on some of their workout stuff. I do not like the lighting. Hold on. Seventeen dollars, and the top twenty. Not bad. This was like one of their sets that they had out. I love the blazer. The blazer is pretty thick. And we found this sweater vest. And then I found the pants that match the blazer. I love the wide bottoms. 
Those type of pants are always a win for me. But the pants are $25, which is the blazer. The blazer's $35. I should check the price before I put it on. Okay, the top is $15. That one, I was looking for a dress to try on. I don't know what is happening down here, but I was so intrigued. And now I have to try it on. Oh, I also found this shirt. Simple white top. It's a good basic. I don't really know what I was expecting, but it looks exactly like how it did on the hanger. <laughs> like, why is it ombre too? It's $48. I wouldn't pay for it, but... I bet if Kendall Jenner wore this tomorrow, everybody would be playing. Help. Everything seemed to have like a general theme. There's a lot of athleisure wear, a lot of um, homebody clothing, homebody aesthetic. I think the most stylish things that they have at TJ Maxx are very chic, very mature, and like Target had a little bit of that. TJ Maxx is all of that. If you know what TJ Maxx is and you know their style and that's your style, there's a whole bunch of things in there that you could totally get. There's good basics. You saw like the two packs of shirts that I saw. There's a lot of those. I saw a lot of that. I guess selections. I give them like an eight and a half out of 10 for selections. There's not many different styles in there. So if that is your style, this is your store. Let's talk about pricing. I feel like the tops range from 15 to 25. Coats range from 25 to like 50. It wouldn't even reach, I don't even think I saw like $50 jack. And the pants as well, 20, 20-ish, 20 25. So it's like, it's affordable. I give, I give their pricing like an eight and a half out of 10. And as for the quality, the quality was good. I didn't touch anything that was like papery. Everything was soft and I love soft things. Quality, nine and a half out of 10. Now we are headed to, see, I would go to Old Navy, but I don't know. Like the last time I went to Old Navy, it was giving very much old. Let's just see what they got. This is so cute. Oh, there's a blue one. Yeah, it's $50. I have so many jeans. I don't like, oh my God, there's just so many. For $55, you can see the lining. These are cute shirts for $8. There's more tops for $8. So here's the first dress. I hate the material. It's $20, it's just so thin. These pants fit perfectly. And they're flared at the bottom. Honestly, I might buy these. I hope they're not actually $56. It's just really good material. These pants are actually interesting because it says balloon on it. And it does look like a balloon. I kind of dig it. And it was on sale. $16.99. That's pretty good. And the top, I forgot how much the top was. I don't think it was $24.99 though. Okay, time to try this on. I want to try this one so bad. Why do I love this sweater? Valentine's Day sweater. This would be so cute. I don't know if it's on sale though. Oh my gosh. I love this pink cardigan. $10 and under? Oh my gosh, $8 jeans? I feel like Old Navy is so bipolar. Let's discuss Old Navy while I'm being blinded. <laughs> Their selections were so good. I thought I was gonna walk into Old Navy and be like, I was thinking school uniforms. That's what I was thinking when I went into Old Navy. But I found some cute stuff, such cute cardigans. That sweater, that heart sweater, I really wanted it. The Stevie pants, that's what they were called, were $29, which wasn't even that bad for that quality. And it fits so well. I didn't end up getting them because like I already have so much clothes and I'm trying to cut down the amount of clothes that I have <coughs> and that I consume. Give their selections like a 9.8 out of 10 to be honest. Pricing was so bipolar. There were some tops that went to like $50 and then there were tops that were also $8. You really have to search through to find those good deals. It's just very like up and down. So I give their pricing, I give it like a six and a half out of 10. See, the quality is like the same thing. That first dress that I tried on, it felt papery. That one like collared top that I tried on was see-through. But then they also did have quality stuff. It's also like hit or miss. I give their quality like a seven and a half out of 10. So that was interesting. I was not expecting that.
Ross really shocked me with the prices. Like everything was basically under $20. The tops were under 10. Pants were around 10 to 20. Jackets were from like 15 to 20, maybe even 25. I don't know, but it was, prices were so good. The selections were okay. <laughs> I don't know if it's because it's just my Ross or like there just wasn't much there. I give it like a, a like a 7 out of 10. The pricing, that gets a 10 out of 10 because I feel like thrift stores nowadays have Ross's pricing. Since everything is cheaper, it makes sense that the quality is a little lower. So I'd probably give them like a 6.5. But for those prices, it's just, it, it's bearable. That's it. I haven't even eaten all day. I'm tired, I have to pee. Life is, life is great.